Victor Meireles de Lima was a Brazilian painter who was born on August 18, 1832, in Nossa Senhora do Destero, Florianópolis, Brazil. He passed away on February 22, 1903, leaving a remarkable legacy in the world of painting. Victor Meireles de Lima was an artist who created artworks in two different art movements, academic art and romanticism. During the academic art period, his paintings were known for their realism, accuracy, and attention to detail while portraying the country's culture and history. When the Romanticism movement emerged in Brazil, Victor Meireles adapted his style to reflect the new trend. He portrayed the landscapes and native people in a more emotional and idealistic way, appealing to the public's romantic sensibility towards art. Victor Meireles de Lima's art was influenced by the Brazilian culture and the historic events that took place in his country. His paintings aimed to depict the Brazilian cultural identity, people's way of life, and struggles with the ecosystem. He was friends with and worked alongside other famous Brazilian painters such as Pedro Americo and Almeida Jr. He was a member of the Brazilian Academy of Fine Arts and established the painting school of Rio de Janeiro, which trained many Brazilian painters. Victor Meireles was born in Brazil to recent immigrants from Portugal. He showed an early talent for art, and at the age of 14, he produced his first known work, A Landscape of Santa Catarina Island. Imperial Councilor Geronimo Qualo was impressed by his work and brought him to Rio de Janeiro to meet Felix Taunay, director of the Academia Imperial de Bellas Arts. Meirelles enrolled at the Academy in 1847 and remained there until 1852. He won the Prix du Voyage for his painting, St. John the Baptist in Prison, that year, which gave him the opportunity to study abroad in Europe. He spent much time in Florence and Rome, studying with renowned artists Tommaso Minardi and Nicola Consoni at the Academia di San Luca. After returning to Brazil, Emperor Pedro II rewarded Meireles with the Order of Christ and made him a knight in the Order of the Rose. This allowed him to become an honorary professor at the Academy, eventually being given the Chair of History Painting. In 1868, he completed some naval history paintings for the government. He executed numerous works for the imperial family and became famous for his giant painting of the Second Battle of Guararapas, which was displayed in 1879 at the Imperial Academy alongside a painting by Pedro Americo depicting the Battle of Ave. However, due to some previous conflicts, Meireles was accused of plagiarism. Nevertheless, he continued to produce art and undertook his most ambitious project, a panorama of Rio de Janeiro as seen from the Moro de Santo Antonio, which was completed in 1888 and won a gold medal at the Exposition Universelle in 1889. After the Brazilian Republic was declared in 1889, Beirelles and other artists associated with the monarchy were removed from their posts at the Imperial Academy. In 1893, he unsuccessfully attempted to start a private school, and he sank into poverty. He even installed his panorama of Rio de Janeiro in a hut and charged a fee, with any proceeds not used for living expenses going to charity. Meirelles died on February 20, 1903, unnoticed and during the Sunday morning carnival festivities, at his modest home. Sadly, his panorama was eventually dumped into Guanabara Bay after being placed into storage and becoming rotted and moldy. Nevertheless, he will always be remembered for his contribution to Brazilian art and for his famous work, Primera Missa no Brasil, the first mass in Brazil. In conclusion, Victor Meireles de Lima was a highly talented Brazilian painter who was known for his remarkable contribution to the world of painting. He created artworks in both academic art and romanticism movements, showcasing his versatility and adaptability. His realistic paintings of Brazilian culture and history stand out for their attention to detail, while his emotive portrayals of landscapes and people reflect the romanticism movement. Meirelles' art was heavily influenced by Brazilian culture and historic events, an attempt to depict the Brazilian cultural identity, people's way of life, and struggles with the ecosystem. His work was recognized and celebrated in his time, even earning him the Order of Christ and a spot in the Imperial Academy. Despite various challenges and accusations of plagiarism, Meirelles continued to produce art until the end. He represents a significant figure in the history of Brazilian art, 
and his contribution will be celebrated for generations to come.